I... I wanted so much to play a duet with you, Tom. Please forgive me. Chasing me too. <laughs> That's why I I went and hid. <laughs> so that's what's been happening. <coughs> oh God, I don't remember anything. But if Jenny says so, uh, I must have. I'm gonna find Parker and be with him. I'm not alone anymore. I'm not afraid of the loneliness. No. Not anymore. Yeah. I wish I hadn't lived to do these things. But until just a few days ago, I had nothing to even regret losing if if I could go back in time and see myself the way I was I would give her a, a hard slap across the face then I'd take her to meet you and Parker and I would tell her these are your friends starting today Laura I've changed my mind if I could just have another chance at life, I'd like to be reborn as myself. And I'd like to have you as my friend again. Promise? Would you be? <sighs> Thank you. Thank you. I'm going now. Don't turn around, please. Please. There's no need to see me off. Remember, this isn't goodbye. We're friends. Friends for life.
white shadow. Allow me to reach you and be in your presence. Grant your great powers unto me. Really dead? I heard everyone talking. Ah! Ah! Look, look, it's Parker. Laura. Laura. between the stars was called courting darkness, darkness. adrift even from sorrow what I see. the survivors turned letters from the sun Fall to ashes courting darkness from the inkwell of their veins the survivors took to weaving words of abomination instead armored the soul and the survivors made a fortress of their folly on the first day they made fire to burn the sky on the second day they made fire to burn the sea on the third day they made fire to burn the earth on the fourth day they made fire to burn the stars on the fifth day there was nothing on the sixth day there was emptiness forbidden, and the darkness began to change, strength began to course, and the strength beget power. You swept a boat out into the swelling river, and guided me across on a link of thoughts, heedless of the water's fearful source, severed from the markers of time. 
The smothering solitude thawed in your light and became a rising tree on a forgiving hill. The tree began a forest, and the forest called forth winged creatures that traced the contour of a heart as they flew. Reconstructing brightness long since forgotten, they overflow, fall from the sky, murmuring their light, crystallize. In the verdance of the trees, gather what falls from the sky, you cried. Fly, you cried. Fly. arrived, as life finally came to an end, as it started, they saw boundless joy, and they knew it was your doing. What you guarded in their stead is the brightness that shines within. What you guarded in their stead, I shall call love. And understand at last. Laura, do you know who you are? You must learn the truth, for the evil one is giving himself to a fear for power even now, and together they shall become the shadow. Laura, you are the chosen one. You must awake. <laughs> Let's go, Laura. Okay, Laura. 
I'm not afraid of dying now. <clears throat> Laura, I want you to do something for me. Leave me here and go. You've got to stay alive. And there's nothing more I can do. I'm all... <sighs> Please, Laura, don't look so sad. You have no idea how happy I've been s spending my last days with you. <laughs> you kept me going. And that's why, more than anything else in the world, I want you to survive. The moment I saw you on that plane, I knew I had to keep you safe. I don't know why, but I just knew I had to. That's why... That's why you've got to survive. All I can offer now is to leave you with a smile. I wish I had something you could take with you. But I... But I... <laughs>